For the first time since the 1988-89 season, the Oilers have 200-point players on the team. Leon Draisaitl joined the likes of Connor McDavid last night with his goal against the Dallas Stars. Since I've been here, they've provided us with a competitive direction to follow. For me, it's become easier and easier to sell to the rest of the group because their top players are playing the right way. I'm more impressed with, you know, the points come and go. Like, they've had great offensive years and they're... They can close and they, you give them an odd man rush and they're going to score. But for me, it's about winning hockey games. And they give us a chance to win every night by the way they play. And now what's happening is that they're impacting the rest of the group to play that way, which is, becomes an easier sell for me. Head coach Ken Hitchcock says though he may not have the same position next season, he plans to have involvement with the team. I just want to help the Oilers. You know, I, I came here for the right reasons and the more I stay here, the more I feel like all I want to do is help the team. So whatever they want me to do, uh, if I can help the team, that's what I want to do. So wherever they think I fit, um, I'm more than willing to help. Jujar Carroll was out on the ice for practice this morning following a lingering injury and could draw back into the lineup as soon as tomorrow night. He felt good and so he looks like he's available for selection for tomorrow. So it'll be good to, as long as he gets through the day and uh, has no setbacks, then uh, uh, we assume that he'll be ready to play tomorrow, so that'll be good for us. He'll, he'll add to the group. For Oilers TV, I'm Jessica Kent.